Hey, what's going on? It's me, Gazbot, and it's day 45 of 100 Days of Making Comics. Thought I'd do things a little different. I've been recording in this same area for a while, uh, but now I just brought... I have the hiccups. Now I just brought it down to a different level. Uh, why? Because crazy! Um, I will probably hiccup throughout this because I've been hiccuping for about an hour, so I am not going to edit it or not re record it. There you go! Hiccupy goes! Um, so my day today was a weird day. Uh, I had to go in for my pre-op exam for my eyes. Um, so I had to drive Q to work and back and that killed like an hour and then going back the, <laughs> to the eye doctor killed like another hour and a half. So without doing anything, a lot of my day was shot. Uh, I was doing more Japan stuff, trying to get that out of the way before the eye surgery as far as booking things. Uh, I had to do a lot of like uh, chore type stuff, had to run to Goodwill and drop off some stuff, had to go to FedEx and drop off some stuff, had to get gas for the car, go to CVS, just all that kind of normal stuff. And then when I picked up Q, uh, we went out to a sushi place by her work and met some friends of ours. Uh, and that was fun, but then we also went out for dessert, which was also fun and delicious. And then we got back and went for a walk, which was healthy and good. Uh, but that means that I didn't start work until like 11 o'clock or so. Uh, so I just put in a half hour. Uh, I would like to have put in the two hour, but after I do the half hour, I got to finish this video, edit it, put it up, and then still book some hotels. Hiccup, 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 hiccup. Those are hiccups. So anyway, uh, today is day 45. Um, what I did was a half hour uh, taking the thumbnails from the first page of issue one and start the process of turning them into a full-size layout rough. Uh, I'll go ahead and put up a process video, which is a half hour, so short and should be pretty short, uh, right here. Okay, so the first thing I did was import the reference uh, designs that I had done previously of the characters, vehicles, uh, and background settings that are going to be used on this page. Um, brought those all in. Now this island shot I wanted is super close to the design I did so I kind of just superimposed the island there. Uh, the top view island I brought in because if you look in the right hand corner of that panel there's something there that I wasn't quite 100% sure was supposed to be. I thought maybe it was part of a bridge or part of the city so I was looking at the bottom area to figure out what it was supposed to be. And uh, here I am tilting it because I realized that the angle I was facing would be more tilted came back to that, uh, went ahead and started cleaning up the red roughs around the design I already had. Uh, and that I won't use that design, I'll pretty much redraw it, but why redraw a rough when I already have pretty much what I want? Uh, put in a couple boats and a couple buoys to make it a little more uh, lived in, because it's right across from a city, so there would be things in the water. Uh, and here I was putting some land, and I started building up part of a bridge or something, and I could not for the life of me remember what was that supposed to be in the... the uh, the thumbnail uh, and, and again I'm, I'm just making the water and the clouds kind of all frame the island nicely uh, I started putting a wall or something there erased it I think in the end I decided to just let that be a little piece of land of the mainland and that's it uh, then I box out these panels uh, the one on the right the third one is supposed to be a big impact panel and I was kind of approaching it a weird way where I did a square first and then cut into it I'm not sure why I did that it was kind of counterintuitive but that's what I did uh, and then the first panel here I got a little squirrel type character uh, it probably won't be literally a squirrel because uh, I don't want it to be uh, exactly earth or exactly our time or whatever but it's basically a not referenced squirrel so that'll make it look not quite right and maybe I'll color it a little differently than a squirrel would be colored uh, and then here I realized if I flipped it it'll move the reader's eye in more if the animal's looking in and I just changed the scale and kind of framed it there the way I like it he's eating a little berry or nut or something uh, and then the same character here but a wider shot standing up noticing a noise uh, and I think I redrew this a few times to get it to look the most like a uh, squirrel or other sort of rodent standing up and I probably should have looked at a reference, and maybe I will for the final, but I got a halfway plausible pose, uh, and then pull back, you see the tree, and uh, a little bit of bush in the front, and some trees in the background, and then a shadow of something, and a couple birds flying away because there was a disturbance. And then the final panel is actually that piece of machinery crashing in, so I had the reference of what that claw grabber thing would look like. 
um, and I want it to be clear that it's smashing through trees and leaves uh, and that it's a piece of machinery but I took a little bit of creative liberty in this one to try to make it look a little more fierce make the make it look a little bit more like animal teeth and I'll probably mess around with this a little bit more in the final but that's pretty much where I got in the uh, half hour uh, as far as what I was going to put in that panel. And then I redid the, uh, oh, I redid the explosion layout so that it's only exploding on half, which I may or may not keep, but I like it better than the whole thing. And so that's half a page sort of roughed out. Ah, there it went. So uh, a little bit of visual, nothing too exciting. Uh, as you can see, it's like still not even to rough pencil phases, but it it's like a polish, 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 kind of similar to the way I wrote, which is probably why I wrote that way, because it's kind of how I draw, where it's just, you know, rough sketch after rough sketch getting closer to what I want it to be uh, until I finally have to stop because time is taking forever, and if I don't stop, I'll never be done, which seems to be a common thing with artists. Um, so, yeah, uh, hate to be short. I'm going to try to post one tomorrow before I go for my surgery, but I have to leave at, like, 12, and i got some things to do in the morning, so I, I may or may not get one up tomorrow. Uh, I want to, but again, this this could be the you don't see me for a few days because of eye surgery thing. And if that's the case, I didn't quit. I just I can't look at computers and stuff. So uh, we're going to call it a quick end of day 45. What? Yeah. I, why? I don't know. Uh, end of day 45. Oh, that means we've got 55 days left, mommy. Hey, baby, 55 days left, daddy.